video for you. The, it, it is Christmas season and everybody's excited in the kitchen and everything. And I'm making a couple of dishes that should, I would say, be on somebody's, you know, Christmas dinner table. Okay? I know we have... Beans, greens, potatoes, tomatoes, lamb, greens, greens, raw, 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 raw. And we have the beef. But guys, we need other... Well, for me, I haven't done fried chicken in a long time and I am going to use this opportunity to make some basic fried chicken wings. Maybe you can have that as little appetizers or sides on your Christmas dinner table, okay? So I am going to show you how I am going to make this delicious, awesome fried chicken wings, okay? Guys, follow me over here. So I can show you the ingredients I will be using to make my chicken. Come on and watch me cook. And come watch me cook. And come watch me cook. Hey! Ha! So here I have um, a few pieces of chicken wings. They are already washed, cleaned with lemon, vinegar, salt, you name it guys. I clean my my chicken. I am um, I don't play around with cleaning my meat. So these are already washed. Um, I am going to season this for you. But guys, what I'm gonna season for you just now? This is not the chicken I'm gonna be using. I have these few chicken wings that I have that's been seasoning since yesterday. So I am gonna use the same ingredients I used to season this chicken. So I am gonna be frying these because they have already been marinated and it is smelling so good. Okay, so I am going in guys with half, um, half a teaspoon of all purpose seasoning. Half a teaspoon of pepper seasoning. I have some garlic salt. I'm going in half a teaspoon as well. Going in with some paprika. Okay. Half a teaspoon as well. I am going in with my adobo. Half a teaspoon as well. You don't want to salt these, over salt these guys. And I, you know, I love um, hot pepper. So I have to kick up my wings with some cayenne pepper. This may be just a little bit over half a teaspoon. Okay. And to give it a very nice um, flavor as well, I'm going in with half a teaspoon of black pepper. And guys, that's it. That's all I am using to season my wings. And I am going to let it sit and marinate. And then I can, and, and then I'm going to put this in the refrigerator. But um, I'll finish this up um, just um, rubbing in the seasoning um, later on. But for the ones that I already have prepared for you, I am going in and this is it. This is it. It's already well seasoned and well prepared. Guys, I will be right back to show you what I'm going to be doing with this chicken. Yeah. All right, everyone. So this is what I have right now. As I said, I am not going to use any um, egg in this fried chicken mix. I'm not going to use any um, cornstarch or anything. I am going to 
use basic flour. My flour is not even season, seasoned, but the amount of season on this, trust me, we don't need any seasoning in this flour. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna go ahead and um, put this chicken in this flour. And just give it a little turn here. Just coat, um, coat it a little bit, shake it off, and put in the oil. In fact, I have my oil over here. Let me see if my oil is hot. I'm just putting a little bit of flour. Yep, my oil is hot enough. It's sizzling a little bit. Okay, let me go ahead and continue to put this, the chicken in this flour. And then I'm just going to um, coat everything. just gonna shake it off because I don't want the flour to burn so so you shake it off as much as you can and I'm just gonna put it in guys these are gonna be so good and I'm taking my time to put my chicken in my oil And guys, I have my stove on medium. I am not going to touch um, my chicken. I'm going to just let it stay and just fry on its own. One minute, guys. Got to wash my hands. Alright everyone, now you can go in and touch your chicken because now the flour um, is coated, in, um, coated enough on the chicken so I'm just going to go ahead see and turn the chicken a little bit. Look at it. See, this is what it's looking like. I'm just turning them gently. See guys, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. So the flour is still on it and I'm not taking the flour off. That's why I told you guys, don't touch the chicken until it gets to a certain point in the frying process. Because if you put the chicken in and then you begin to turn it, the flour is going to wash off the chicken. Okay? So... It's on its way. I'm giving it um, um, a few more minutes and then I'll come back and turn it again and show you what it looks like. All right, everyone, my chicken is done. And look at this. Look at that. Look how crispy that chicken looks. Okay, guys, and I am just going to put it over here, right? I'm taking them out of the pot. Look at that. Oh my goodness. This is going to be so good. These chicken wings. When I tell you these chicken wings look so good. Look at that guys. These are going to be so crunchy. 
and that's exactly what I want them to be so when you put your chicken in the pot you don't need to be um, moving it around and checking on it just let it cook on its own okay and this is what the result you will see from your fried chicken by just leaving it let it fry on its own look how good those chicken looks I am gonna go ahead and let this the oil drain off this chicken and I will come back and present this chicken to you okay everyone this is the finished product of my fried chicken wings and these are just basic fried chicken wings without eggs without um, the seasoning in the flour just basic fried chicken wings guys look how beautiful these wings look not only are they beautiful I know they are as tasty as well and right here guys I have some mango chili um, sauce to eat with my chicken I am gonna dip it in my chicken guys look at this I know these just came out of the oil and they are still hot but look at this Oh my goodness. You hear that crunch? Oh. Mm. Oh my god. This is amazing. Well, let me go ahead and present it to you all. Guys, this is so so good. I'm going to go ahead and dip my chicken in the sauce. This is amazing. This sauce tastes so good with this chicken. Oh, thank you, Jesus, for blessing my hands so I can share with you what God has blessed me with. Guys, go ahead and try this recipe or recreate it. Do whatever. But you can fry chicken in so many different ways. And this is just basic fried chicken wings. This is amazing. Thank you so much for watching me cook. And I'm coming with another video for you real soon. Guys, this is awesome. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And also follow me on Instagram at Lois Cooking Corner. God bless you all. Merry Christmas and a prosperous 2020. And I pray the blessings of the Lord envelop you in every area of your life you will have a 2020 vision clear and precise in the year 2020 in jesus name blessings on you all until i see you again have a wonderful day